Yep. I need you to work. There you go. Excuse me while I sneeze like 5,000 times. Phew. I don't know why. As soon as it's like, hey, I'm going to record, I just couldn't help but start sneezing. Where? There it is. So I know it's around here somewhere. <clears throat> now, is this enough? Question is, do I want to make this be able to go down to the planet to refuel? That probably would be a wise idea. If I did, though, the, the amount of thrust for that would be kind of ridiculous. So I think that this needs to be a space vessel only. So this will be my new jump ship. It's going to replace... If I can find it. Let me guess, because I'm in this... Options. It, this is like the, the battle that I have to do. Okay. 10 jump. So that's going to be replacing this vessel right here. It's going to fall to the ground though. <laughs> so it's going to be replacing this dude. See the size comparison. Very, very large size comparison right here. And I'm going to upgrade it with using hydrogen so it can move a little bit faster. Yeah, it did serve me well. Uh, it just needs a bigger brother to jump farther because when I built that ship, we weren't really moving resources that were in large ships at the time. So this ship is going to have a brother made with the idea of this one as well. I want to build a... Um, Shoot, what's the movie called? Hold on while I try to think of the movie. It's an idea from a movie. I, it's all I know. is It's, it's, it's kind of like a drop pod. So it's going to have like a lot of thrusters on it too. Like a lot of large thrusters. And it's going to be able to carry just one large cargo container. Full. And it's going to have to have at least five hydrogen tanks of fuel. Because it will go to space. It would connect to this ship. This ship would jump to wherever you're going. And then it would be able to drop back onto the planet. I was wanting to do one that used parachutes, but if you do the math, you would need so many parachutes that it just wouldn't be worth it. You would actually, you'd have to add the weight of the parachute blocks themselves to try and figure out how many parachutes you need. So it, it would just, it just become too much of a hassle. But this guy is going to be our new, new jump ship. It's got, as you can see, a lot more jump drives than the other one does. I'm thinking of it as like leaving it kind of exposed, but at the same time, these blocks are expensive. Do I have a welder somewhere? No. You know, I'm going to do something I haven't done in a while. I do not want to switch. Uh, mark is red in this one. Oh, I can't. Oh, that sucks. I am going to be in the voice channel. So, if anybody wants to hop in there, they can. Of course, it's not going to tell me when someone because I'm in streamer mode, but it's okay. Yeah, I mean, I can make it where it wouldn't be so clunky. I think that this is going to need another couple of tanks, though. The tanks will be protected, I think. So you are... We'll go with three in the front and back. That should honestly be enough. I don't know how fast they're going to drain. Let's see, where's the little button on these things? Um, 
so they're filled with a hundred hundred liters of fuel let's google this I want to know hydrogen engine space engineers hydrogen engine rates of consumption rate there we go see somebody else has already asked the question every watt hour it produces while the large Huh. Wow, so you can have one hydrogen or O2 generator can power looks like almost ten hydrogen engines. That's actually kind of impressive. Oh, okay, you could have nine. Okay, that makes sense. Um Yeah, and I'm also using that for hydrogen thrusters. Huh. Okay. So that's good to know, I guess. Um, it also would uh, take away the weight if this was like all the way armored. All right, let's do, I don't think I want these to be connected to anything. Like I'm gonna have to figure out a way to attach things. So we're gonna do something like that. This is a nice thing about building in creative. You can Oh, I should have the uh, the mirror thing going on. That way I can build the back and front because I do believe it is mirrored. If it's not, we'll figure out real quick. That won't be. Okay. Let's see if I place you right there. Does it place it on that one? It does. All right. And then we'll do that. Is that two different colors right there? It is, isn't it? Oh, well, maybe not. Okay. Maybe I can actually do colors right. <laughs> okay, so we'll we'll do like a support going right here. I was just playing on the uh, space engineers world world that I've been playing on for a while. I built I built a little bit more into that world so it's a little bit more polished in preparation for what I need now and that is logistics on a much larger scale than those one ships can do <laughs> so that's why today is the first hour of the stream will probably be just going in creative well it's gonna be more than an hour because I, I tend to build really slow all right and then we're gonna double it down so let's see so that'd be six. Okay, and then one, six, and then you're like so. Okay. So now I can get rid of that and that. And then this whole area will just be. Okay. And we'll do one over here. Okay, so let's mirror that. And then we'll do this. Now, if I need to, like, add some color to this, I will. Alright. And then we do six. Now, is that part needed right there? Is that just an oops? It's probably an oops. Okay. Or it does not connect to anything, which is okay. I will come below. I mean, it is connected right there, so that's fine. Yeah, nothing fell. All right, so that is a good chunk of shell done. Protects the hydrogen tanks. I mean, if one of those goes off, I'm pretty sure it would be pretty bad. 
I have an idea. Let's test this. Um, what can I spawn in and just shoot a hydrogen tank, see what it does damage-wise? You remember the crazy uh, space freighter that I built that also will be in conjunction with that? I think I'm just building a new style that that I'm trying out where it's like a funky style. I wonder what will happen when this falls. There is hydrogen tanks in there. Is it actually going to float? That's kind of cool. Alright, let's see which one has some empty spots. Alright, character weapons. I guess we want this one. Oh, cool. Um... Alright, I'm curious, how much damage is this going to do to this? Wow, doesn't really do that much damage to a full block, does it? That's good though. Small grid is it devastates, but large grid it does. Oh, it's rolling. Okay, what, what does it do to one of these? Does some pretty good AoE. I want one of those tanks to blow up. I want to see what the damage is. I, I could have grinded it down too properly, but. Oh, <laughs> yeah, it's going to sit like this now, isn't it? Because now it's technically. Oh, there goes a. O2 gen. Jeez. Uh, air tools. Doesn't really matter. I just want to see how bad they're damaged. Okay. Um, you know, that's kind of surprising, honestly. Two more probably. Well, maybe one more. Who knows? Okay, explosion occurred. You took no damage. So they must have took that out, because I thought at one point it would actually damage if you know those got blown up. Now just because I'm curious, what does it do to that? Oh look at that. One shot's a solar panel. Cool. Okay. Uh okay. Back to one. <laughs> that kind of looks cool in the, from the distance. Yeah, this is my credit world for everything. Well, not everything. I have another world that has ships, more ships in it. But this one, I started building a new aircraft carrier. Um, it's somewhere farther away. I think it's that one over there. It's right next to that ship. But it has a balance issue that was frustrating so I just haven't been working on it for a while all right so I guess we'll honor this right here let's go to six I think we're gonna end up doing a whole shell and it's gonna be a big giant clunky mess or I can leave the sides open Let's see, we'll do, we'll do an orange stripe. Let's say about right here. And we'll go to about right there. Followed by blue stripes. One of my things is I like to build things and then I build a version 2 and the version uh, 2 has something different you know from things I've learned with the other one and then I'll build a version 3 and a 4 and so on. The thing with this thing is I don't 
It's going to need more forward thrust. So like the back, I got to somehow build it to where it can be forward thrust. Alright, we're going to go back to the black. I believe it's this one. Alright, and then we're going to have to do that. We're going to get rid of you. So it's a protective shell. I mean, that's kind of all we're wanting to do. Somebody would attack from the bottom, they would definitely be able to do some damage. I think the the bridge is probably going to be underneath. It, I could make it kind of like a blimp. Have like a part that's in the middle that dangles down and be all glass and have its own O2 system. That would probably be kind of smart. This has enough uh, jump drives, it should be able to go pretty far. Empty, it probably will go the farthest I've ever been able to travel in one entity of the game. Not sure how to round some of this off. Oh, there is different colors going on. Okay. Yeah, I figured there was wrong colors going on. Shoot. So I was using the... Okay, well, see, that's just why you just double check your work sometimes, I guess. Okay, that means the whole... Bottom is probably wrong too, then, right? No? Okay. That's wrong, though. Even though it does actually look kind of good. With different colors going on. Oh, yeah, the the other color is what I usually use for uh, bridge decks and stuff. So, for instance, on the, the creative world, I'm using uh, that color to build the. the, the um, right next to the runway. So that I can dock ships, the uh, spaceships that I got. And I, uh, in today's stream, I do plan on building an a uh, like storage area for those, so that they're not on the runway. They'll be actually technically off the runway, and they shouldn't get the glitch where their wheels pop off. And they can recharge or charge the base, whatever happens. Okay, so let's figure out. This chunk right here. I might even put solar panels on this just because you know more fuel choices. Uh -huh. Alright, and then I'm gonna go ahead and go back and make this the blue color. I'm pretty sure one of these toolbars has solar panels. Let's find the center. Okay, so we'll do it right there. I know it's not a lot of solar panel, but it's better than nothing. Let's see, three, six, three. Why doesn't everyone want to build the one? So that would be another, like, let's say for some reason hydrogen was run out I could then turn off all the jump drives and resupply that would be kind of the purpose of that and then we're gonna do I'm gonna redesign this whole wing tip but in order to do that hmm. we're gonna get rid of that Okay, so let's see, I'm gonna go, okay, I think I might lower that one, have it sit underneath, yeah, let's lower it one, uh, 
That thing should fall if I destroy that, right? Okay, good. So we'll get rid of you. Seven. Um, let's do this one instead. Okay. There we go. So two, three. I'm honestly just trying this out right now. I don't actually have a plan for it yet. I guess technically I could have. I could have done what I was doing earlier. Okay. So let's get rid of that. Just waiting to accidentally delete something that drops something. <laughs> okay, and you are just supported by such. Okay. Then we'll do like a trim right here. And we're going to do this. Now the big guy was right in this area, so we're going to put this in right here. Now who has that big guy? You do. Okay. So what we'll do is put the big guy such like so. Okay, and we need yellow because I want this to be yellow. Oops. Okay, four. Let's get rid of you. Too many sorters anyway. So I could sneak a thruster up and down right here, it's not nine. And the reason why I would do this is so that there's not as many uh, conveyor blocks. Man, I am not hitting the right number today. Nine. Rotate around. All right, so that gives us forward, backwards, up and down, which, I'm not going to lie, that's definitely not a lot of up and down for us for this big of a ship. For in space, you know, it's a decent amount. This thing's going to weigh a lot. I don't think I have gyroscopes on this thing, do I? I'm going to have to hide those somewhere as well. Alright, we're going to put in another blue, another blue, and let's see, back to yellow. So we're going to put two thrusters right here. Then we're going to take you we're gonna 
so it's about right there. I want to see how many more forward little guys we can get. So we'll do one, two, and three. Don't want to, you know, overdo the thrust there that bad. Um, so then we'll do one, two, three. And then one, two, three. So that will give us a lot more than what we had. More stopping thrust, but double the four thrust, which works with me. And we're gonna go back to the black. I actually kinda wanna do white. Add a different color, but it might be a little too much. Unless I do like some white pinstripes on this thing somewhere. It would be a good place for some solar panels. What number was those in five? Yeah. Let's do a couple more. If you have the space, you might as well use it. figure out do I want to just line the bottom with uh, probably should okay we'll do the blue stripe down the middle Oh no, wrong block I'd hit. Back to orange, please. Okay. I mean, yeah, we'll be probably doing. Uh, what are you looking like at the top? So it's not. Oh. All right, then black it is. How many blocks is that? 192. Yeah, this thing's gonna be a little bit heavy. But that's, that's okay. Okay. This also gives me more space for more uh, tanks. How did this one get black? <laughs> All right, let's find the center. We'll line up you. What do you think? That'd be what? 40? 40 of those guys? That should be all right. Okay, and let's do this color again. <laughs> and I guess the whole idea, this is camouflage, so if, when you're in space, you're going to be like, what is that giant black thing flying towards me? Surprise, you're dead now. And we're gonna do a white stripe. Like I said, I need to break up the, the coloring just a little bit.
forward. Up, down. Very little left, right. Very, very little left, right. That's also something I gotta figure out. Um, well, I can sneak one in right here. Put one. I don't think anything can damage that, right? Yeah, that should be enough. All right, let's uh, do the little dangly thing. Uh, we're gonna have it coming down with you. All right, so that's the center. Now it's it's not gonna like hang down too far I don't think so I would like it symmetrical let's do that alright get rid of you okay It's going to be a giant airship in space. Hey, more sun, what's up? Make it just a tad bit wider on the bottom, or I should, you know what? It, it's it doesn't need to be that big or roomy. So I am going to go with the ultimate decision of well, just trying to get a little bit of something going on here. Okay, so that will be uh, actual support. Let's do the floor. We'll do it as the actual dark gray. Okay. Let's see. Do six. Needs to be inverse. I believe that's inverse, yes. Um, shaman. Sometimes it's hard to tell if you got the inverse or not. And that will be... Do the white right here. For no particular reason other than I'm just going to do the white right there. And I could put like the beacon and stuff down here underneath this as well. That would like kind of round off the bottom and give it a little bit more structure. Where is the exact center? So we'll go down five. And that will give me like a little bit of space. I can put some stuff down here if I need to. Let's see, we're going to do that so just for a little bit of detail work. Stuff that I will never probably notice. Have you built anything crazy on your uh, Space Engineer Adventures, Morrison? Control seats. I get rid of the. Uh... Hold on. There we go. 
All right, what are we removing? That one, yep. Okay. One of these has a control seat. Is it heavily armored or what? Why is it so many blocks? Uh, blocks. Okay, you're going right there. Uh, we need to fill this in. There's going to be an O2 system probably up here. Oh. And I'll probably build that honestly in survival. So let's go to I info. Oh, 3,000 blocks, not too shabby. 16,000 PCU, though, that's a problem. Alright, and let's do three. A light there. And a light there. Is it 66,000 of heavy armor or light armor? I'd like to see it move if it's heavy armor. <laughs> uh... You know what, I might as well put in the O2 system here. Where is my O2 box? Uh, there's, pretty sure there's one somewhere, I don't know where it's at. Oxygen will go right there. Now there should be an air vent in one of these. No air vent, really? Okay. Did you mix in any heavy armor at all? Because, I mean, light armor can get shredded really quickly. I think this will be solid so it fits in a door. And I'll probably put some sort of like catwalk thing. Where was that angled piece at that I was using? There it is. Uh, the P. Okay. So there'll be catwalks here. Ooh, artificial gravity would be nice to have. I don't, yeah, you can have artificial gravity. It doesn't affect that. All right, so we need to add in something like this so that I can take you out in a second. Dude, they need to stop talking so much today. Uh, in a second, I'm trying to f finish my thought. If I can. I know I have a gravity generator somewhere. Let's spin on a different crater world that was building stuff. Okay, and then we're gonna slim it down. Where was this one box at? It kind of looks like a giant airship right now. I just like hiding stuff in here. Uh, you know, yeah, let's let's do the full block. It's better armor. Oh yeah, that's open. Uh, he must be having problems.
But it's not really meant for a planet, it's just meant for space. But yeah, this is what we got so far. I I, I think I, I started building, I was like, you know what, might as well build a... Yeah. Hey, hello. Are you having trouble <coughs> connecting? Always have trouble connecting. Hang on, though. Okay. Uh, let's get But I'm streaming, just FYI. <laughs> okay. I saw them. But halfway through, I decided to make this into an airship, so... Oh boy. <laughs> let's see... Put you... Would look better. <clears throat> Frontward facing one. And then we'll put some lights on the bottom. Did you download the new mod? Or buy the new DLC? I did not. There's some cool lights. Well, there's two new lights, I think, for the small blocks. Eh, I'll probably get it when it goes on sale. Where... Do I not have a beacon? I have all these toolbars, and yet no, <coughs> no blocks that I actually need. We're gonna just set it out in the open. It doesn't need to be protected. And there was new uh, passageways. Yeah, I mean, I and don't really guns. ever use that stuff. The guns are yeah. free. The guns were, you didn't have to buy it. Oh, well, yeah? Yeah. I don't remember what else. Wait it's a like minute. It's like $4. It was a bag. <laughs> Why did it build the other side, but... Man, I don't want to have to mirror this again. <laughs> well, on the bright side, I think it's just as simple as doing that. <sighs> Are you in multiplayer? I or think online? so. This should be online. I mean, it showed that you connected, but then you disconnected. Yeah, well. <clears throat> no, why? How is it, if it was built in mirrored mode, how is it not building it correctly? <laughs> oh, that's prob That's a lot. Holy cow. Hmm. Uh, yeah. Huh. So much for it being. A while. Oh, is it like a gigabyte or something? It's just like the total mods that need to be downloaded is a, a gig and a half. Well, on the bright side, you should have almost all those mods already downloaded. It just says that it's downloading it again, but it's really not. did that. Well, it sucks. So I, I finally got the wild hair of my rear end to, to play Flight Sim. And, uh, yeah, it needs a 68 gig update. Yeah. It's like, jeez. Like, come on. Yeah, that'd be your graphics for the game now. A couple of coworkers were talking about it. It's just, it's like, what with the heat? They rarely, they rarely have a small update. It's always excessive. Well, it's Microsoft. <laughs> They're like notorious for having ridiculous stuff like yeah. that. I guess so. It's yeah. I need to see how big is that. I guess I can do that temporarily. I'm just mirroring this anyway. Okay. <coughs> yeah, 
Okay, this is just my creative world too. This isn't even the actual. And this is supposed to be orange. I have two things that I'm trying to develop. I'm trying to build a new jump ship. You remember the small jump ship that we like threw together in like five seconds? Yeah. I'm, I'm trying to build one that can jump even further than that one. Like, a lot further. Because I was using that one to, to jump, like, uh, I don't remember how much the ship weighed. It didn't weigh that much, but it could only jump at, like, 4,000 kilometers. Which, you know, yeah, that's a lot. But the actual jump is 6,200 and something kilometers. So now, I'm trying to build one that will be able to take even more and jump at, hopefully, the same distance that I need. And it's not going to be powered by... I need to add ice. Uh, it's not going to be powered by uh, large reactors. It's going to be powered mainly by hydrogen fuel. <clears throat> and then the sister ship that this thing will need will be another ship that can... It's pretty much all it's going to do is it's literally just going to be a large uh, cargo container. Uh, probably like two or three large hydrogen tanks. And then I'm going to have to do the math on how many um, large thrusters it needs just to get off the gravity. And uh, that will be the like next ship that I will start building a couple of. And then the, the idea is that whenever I need to end bulk move stuff, I can just fill the container <coughs> and fly it around. Yeah. I already know that I need at least... I think they're a million kilograms for each of the large thrusters. So I'd probably need like 14, 15 large thrusters. Which is a lot. Just to get out of gravity. And once you're out of gravity, well, I can turn on like the small thrusters and traverse that way. But yeah, it'll be a... For what it's going to be for, it's going to be a giant ship. Unless I can think of a way to make it where it doesn't have to be so large. Alright, so that means that these blocks are no longer required. Goodbye. Oh, I did have gyroscopes. Okay, well, that means I can get rid of these then. <laughs> So dark in here. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> oh, 22.3 megabytes out of a gig and a half. <laughs> that, that's that's pretty slow. <laughs> hey, that's that's bad. Is your reception not good? That should be fine. Or something Actually, else I'm downloading, because, I mean, you haven't been having your computer on lately, so it, it probably is trying I... to download something else. Mm -hmm. good... Probably a Windows be, update. Oh, Windows no. has done probably five updates since we last played. No, uh, my computer is actually updated. I have actually have been updating my computer. Uh, I've, I've started turning it on about uh, a week and a half ago. And yeah, I turn, I open up Steam, just like, oh, all my games need to be downloaded, or need to be updated. So yeah, um, majority of my stuff has been updated. I don't see anything being updated besides the base engineer stuff, software center. Can't. I must have deleted it because it kept flipping. My computer is up to date. All right. Well, that's one less thing downloading then. Yeah, I don't even think this one has that many mods on it. it has weapon packs, mods. and that's it. 
Well. Yeah, but they're with all weapons. Do you have that one? Because we've we played with that one before. Yeah, but if it... but I don't have that downloaded on my worlds, right? So it doesn't update. Uh. I have a speed mod, one of the uranium mods. Yeah. Uranium nuts. Anyways, um. And I have a couple other mods. I forget what they are now. One's a weapon pack from one of the earlier ones. They use bomb weapons. Oh, yeah. I don't really use that one anymore. <clears throat> I don't. I forgot what the other one is. <laughs> All right. Let's see. We do this. Um, I turned it off. Okay. All right. So I'm gonna get rid of the dangle thing here because it's not needed. And then we're going <coughs> to convert this bad boy to a, a ship. Info. Oh, it is a ship now. So wait a minute. How much is that? Wow. 5.6 million. Okay. Well, let's just do a quick test. I just need the main jump drive. Jump. Let's go to... Now we do the K. Let's hide all of the gyroscopes. Show on terminal. I do have a lot of batteries, which is good. Just corp. <coughs> jumper. We'll just call it jumper. Might as well go all the way with that. Show in terminal. Hide <coughs> stuff we don't want to see. Inventory and terminal. Broadcast, <clears throat> might as well go. What? How did, what? Oh gosh. Uh, I don't know how I did that. Huh, okay, well I figured that out. <laughs> Uh, what was I doing again? There we <coughs> go. Um, let's just put all these into one thrust. Put all these into one thruster group. Might as well put all these in one too. <coughs> this will be for stockpiling. I wonder if switching to the other internet would be better. Hydrogen tanks. All right, so we only need to see this to one. <coughs> I don't need those. Terminal. I unfortunately need that, so we'll hide all of you. Oh, darn. Okay, save, show block a terminal. Okay, so we can jump 15,000 kilometers. That's pretty good, but that's not fully loaded. I think it's uh, for every. Uh, million kilograms it takes the full jump drive to jump what was it two thousand kilometers two thousand kilometers something like that all right i'm curious how fast can we go really quickly it's pretty good yeah that's not bad we stopped pretty good too okay that will work uh, let's go here. I info. Hey, it's got a name that's kind of original now. Uh, it's a jump ship, so <laughs> I called it the jumper. <coughs> uh, okay. 
We'll make this, uh, I guess white as well. Okay, which one has my door? One of these has a door. Maybe? Maybe not. Um, I might hide some more jump drives in here, actually. Let's do this one for no reason. Okay. Control panel, sliding door, show and turn. Oh, you, you know what's really funny? Is uh, yesterday when I was preparing for when, when me and you were going to join? <coughs> yeah. You're going to like what I named the uh, med, med, med bay that I want you to spawn in. <laughs> oh. I don't remember what I, I you, called uh, it. Did you leave your game, by the way? No, I'm still in it. Oh, okay, it says you left the game. Well, if you switch they internet, you'll have to rejoin Twitch. Or not Twitch, well, sorry. Space Engineers. <clears throat> oh, I was in the right screen. That's my bad. One of the servers are going freaking crazy with pinging everybody. I do not appreciate it. You'll even be proud of me on one of the vehicles that I've made. I actually put lights on it. Oh, hey. And not just like one or two, <clears throat> like, it's lit. Okay. Now the fun part. Let's see. I want to make. I think we definitely are going to add a couple more jump drives right here. What is the worst that can happen for adding more jump drives? I mean, we can go further. We could literally add a whole another row, too. Or we can just run out of power, and next thing you know, we're stranded in the middle of nowhere. See, that's why it's got solar panels. You can turn turn off stuff. No. Yeah. I'm going to hop off here, Discord, for a few minutes. I'll call you back. Okay. <clears throat> All right. Bye. Bye. Uh... Okay, we're going to probably color it after the fact. I'm trying to think, do I want to... That's also why this thing has battery backup. somehow because I don't know how that's going to round off right here six and that's going to have to be a full block otherwise you'll be able to see inside I believe yeah okay and then we'll cut you off It's going to be hard to actually make this kind of rounded, I think. Maybe like right there? What is that? Five, five blocks. Okay. I mean, that's decent. Okay. Something tells me I'm not going to like the front of this at all. Mm -hmm. I can do that. And we can do that with this as well. Just gotta fill in the gap right here. Yeah, it's a little derpy, not gonna lie, but I can cut 
cut it off and try something else. I'll try something else. Get rid of you. Okay, what do we want to try? What is this distance right here? 10. Of course, it's not an odd number. <laughs> Why would it be an odd number? <laughs> Shoot. Oh uh, boy. So, hmm, I believe that's supposed to be blue anyway. All right, we will have it come out. A couple blocks at least. We'll do six. All right, and then we'll do that. that. Actually, we'll switch it. We'll switch to this block because I. It's easier to make corners with this than it is with the other block. What is that going to be for? Well, we're going to have to manage with a four, four block gap then. Or, I have an idea, hold on. So we're going to do that. Okay, so that just made that a little bit smaller. Okay. Still's got to download though. Okay, and then we'll do that. It's been five minutes already. I don't believe it. And then we can run that off. Hopefully attached somewhere. Let me get rid of you. Put you like a so. We can make it a spear in the front, just a sharp point. Alright, and then six. Luckily with the back, all I'm wanting to do is... Doesn't work, does it? Uh, six. Okay, so that means this whole thing's gonna go, which is okay. Okay, and then we can add that right here. Okay, I just was getting a little ahead of myself, is what it was. for good measure. All right, you're the center, so let's see what we can do with something. We'll do One, two, 
one, two, three, four, and that's five. Yeah, no kidding. Uh, okay, so that's got to go, because you need to be like that. And then that ruins this whole part right here. Which ruins that part. Okay, there we go. Meow? Wolf. Speaking of meow, though, so my neighbor has two cats. One's like a they're both long hair, one's like a Persia, one's a Himalayan. I guess that's the color. Anywho. <clears throat> but, uh, they both like to go for walks. Uh, yeah, there's people that like to walk their cats. <laughs> oh, they, 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 they get walked. One, two, three, four. Alright, well, we're just going to do some simple shenanigans here, I think. Simple shenanigans. Don't never seem simple. Yeah. <clears throat> I'm trying to make a rounded front. It's just not working that well for me. Oh yeah, uh, that, that, that's very tedious. Yeah. Well, this, this download's just about done. <coughs> <coughs> Oh yeah, that's how I can color that. Let's see that. Hey, look at that. Alright, so we need white again. Okay, and that will be that finished then. We're going to go back to black. Alright, we'll do the blue. I mean, honestly, the color kind of hides it for me, so that's nice. Okay, mm. that will be there. Uh, orange. <sighs> and blue. Alright, so I believe that is... This looks so funky. I need to put some like eyes on it. It looks like a dirt plane, like a, like a kid's toy plane. Yeah. All right, we gotta paint you blue. That's what it reminds me of, anyway. Um, and then you're gonna be black. Okay. White. Concrete plus. Yeah, it's a like a part of another mod, but like I never use it. It adds like concrete blocks that you can build in the game. Yeah, they can take a little bit more damage, but they're so freaking heavy you can't really use them for anything but stuff on the ground. But explosions really hurt them, which doesn't make sense because in real life concrete blocks would be. You know, pretty freaking strong. Alright, let's go with a couple more tanks because you did bring up a valid point earlier. Let's see. 
Oh, there's a spot I left open right here. And there. Okay. the Chills Corp logo on here. When I say logo, it's not a logo, it's just a... Huh. Is my character's actually... <laughs> That's funny. The visor was open. It's because I'm in, in creative mode. wrong color <laughs> wrong color again okay so this is gonna be you So, one of these large thrusters will go somewhere, like right here-ish. And then we're just going to grab you. Guess I'll let this download. You're off tomorrow. Are you off tomorrow too? Yeah. Okay. Oh. Oh, getting old. That sucks. Yeah. I know a thing or two about that. Yeah. Well, I'm on mid shift this week. And I'm on day shift. I, I start off on day shift on Monday, and then switched over to mids, and my body is just struggling. I still really haven't adapted to my schedule. I still don't <laughs> like it. But we're gonna be bidding again, so fingers crossed I get what I was wanting the first time. <laughs> I can tell you it's not going to happen, but I might get something a little bit better. I can yeah. hope. That's all I'm doing right now is just hoping. Uh, let's do that. All I know is that the job is affecting my personal life, and I don't like it. Yeah, mine is too. <clears throat> and they don't want to do anything about it and I'm just like really? I was like that's kind of stupid come here pen that a girl you can overhang a little bit I suppose um yeah, like, because I'm on graveyards this week, I couldn't have a Weston. So it's like, well, this sucks. <clears throat> so I, I woke up. 
I woke up yesterday, I ran over to the northwest side of town and hung out with him for several hours and such a good kid. We watched a, after we had dinner, we watched a movie and his mo his mother's like, am I the only one here that doesn't find it, find this amusing? I'm like, yeah, pretty much because <laughs> Jen and I were both laughing our butts off at, at the movie. Oh man, I still have to build the bottom of this part. <laughs> Shoot. Uh, I want to go see so yeah. the, the new King Kong movie. Oh uh, yeah? Yeah. <clears throat> Come on, Penny. I thought about taking vacation to come see you, but... Uh, based on how things are going right now, I don't really think that I can get away. Oh yeah? Because I definitely need to get away from work for a good week. <laughs> yeah. I'm getting there. That I am. Sometimes just dealing with people every day, I'm talking about coworker wise, can just get you. Yeah. It takes one bad apple to ruin it for everybody, is all I can say. Yep. Ain't that the truth. Alright, where should I put the ports to connect? Probably on the yeah, top. Yeah, so... <clears throat> I was hoping we would... would make it to Alaska yesterday, or last night. But, uh... Stuff broke, so that didn't happen. And they're like, well, we're going to try again Friday night. I'm like, well, I was hoping we wouldn't because I have to move my trailer on Saturday morning. So, Saturday's going to suck. <laughs> oh, it's going to suck big ones. You know, instead of doing large cargo containers for ice, let's do a small cargo container. A couple of those, that way I can cut down on the uh, weight of this thing. Penny Lane, where do you think you're going without me? <laughs> Wherever I want. Come on. <laughs> Pretty much. Alright, we'll leave it like that. I might put one in the front too. Probably not. <coughs> so, we'll connect. I mean, two ships would, would be too bad, I guess. Maybe, maybe can connect a couple more. All right, so the hydrogen stuff needs to be its own circuit, which technically I think it's all going to be anyway. So let me figure out where's my cargo containers. Uh, here we are. How many cargo containers should I have? They hold 160,000. Uh, let's do one, two, Morning. three, four, five. That'd be a million, I think. Maybe. Maybe not. Doesn't matter. And the ice that the... Oh, I don't have O2 generators on here, do I? Go. Inside. Do I not have O2 gen... I thought I, oh, I added those. Oh, snap. Oh, that's a problem. I hear those are helpful. Yeah. You wanna I, you wanna tweet? There you go, good girl. Well, I was thinking of making it where you have a ship resupply it, but honestly, that that might be a little much. I mean, the the space station could technically do it. <coughs> that just means I'd have to build a space station, and then be able to supply the space station with ice, which is what. I'm kind of already working on now. The space stations do have... I can never build a display. Like, I have an idea for a space station. I've always had an idea for the space station. I just never can get it to turn out the way I want it to. Yeah, I have quite a lot of I think I... hydrogen. 
I think I, I think I just get impatient. I don't know. <sighs> yeah, maybe maybe I will make it where these get powered from the space stations. So that would maybe just like one or two backup O2 gems. Hmm. Okay, let's get rid of you. You. All right. So we'll leave these two. Now I know I have O2 generators somewhere. If I don't. Oh, two. We'll add like f eight of them. Oops. That should be. All right. Control panel. Show in terminal. That I mean, it just gives them a little bit more sustainability whenever they're actually out in the world. Thrusters save on off. Uh, show terminal. Let's see. It just means I would have to manually fill them with ice. Which they might be able to do through. I'm not sure. Oh yeah, it's a good thing I did this because one of the tanks is actually empty. Alright, now how do I get out of here again? Which, where did I put that hole at? It's somewhere up here, right? Uh, yeah. So, we go back to here. Where's that sliding door at? We're going to put a sliding door here. There you are. Because I need to be able to access this part in the future. Okay. Connector. So we'll put connectors on the sides. Okay, so that means this thing is pretty, pretty able to do what it needs to do. I think it also put some solar panels on the side, but let's check the weight now. Okay. <laughs> this is like a giant torpedo. Which is all right. It's just meant to jump. How far can we jump now? We can jump 15. Okay. Well, I'm okay with that. So when this thing is fully fueled up and going, I'm pretty sure it will be. I don't even remember where. Let me check on the space station because I don't think it actually I built any of the hydrogen spots yet. Because once again, this ship is not meant to carry resources. It's just meant to take vehicles that can. Um, yeah, I think this is... Is that a... Oh, it's a doorway. Okay. So the O2 generators are down there. So yeah, maybe... I think it is all connected. It is, okay. Okay, so that's good. I mean, the whole system's connected, which has its downsides, but at the same time, I mean, it, it, it should work. Um... Need to add another control seat to there, or actually, honestly, just need to add a couple passenger seats to it. That way, if anybody else is sitting. So yeah, if I added a connector somewhere down here, that'd be all right. Okay. Let's get rid of the locket. Uh, I need. Passenger, no, what was that? Passenger side two. Interwasting. Okay. 
Okay. Alright, we're gonna put the seats over here. Oops. Okay. Okay. Passenger seat. Show an inventory, show a terminal. I don't want to see those things. Show in terminal. I'm going to leave the oxygen tank just because. Okay, so that's, that's true. That actually doesn't... Because then it's probably going to try and fill up. Uh, it could be a problem. All right, so let's see. Stockpile on off. That should honestly be all I need. So if we do that, the hydrogen thruster should turn off eventually, I think. Maybe not. Alright, let's see. This is going to take a ton. I mean, an absolute ton of jump drive components. Mm I think go for that one right there. It actually moves pretty well. Maybe I can get rid of some of the gyroscopes. Cause those are some pretty heavy blocks. is taking forever. <laughs> 395 megs out of uh, four and a half gigs. Yes. It might be smart for me to send a screenshot of the mods I have and you just download them. It's, it's, it's trying to download full 26. Well, now you know the struggles I had for years. Yeah. I mean, you're literally right exactly at the struggles I had. <laughs> yeah. I actually may just... I'm not doing it today. I don't have the energy. But maybe tomorrow I'll, I'll just go to the house for a little bit and update. And then play online maybe I don't know depends what my who has plans for me for tomorrow this actually does move pretty good that's good they're uh, potty training the youngster Mm. Alright, so we'll do three, and then just because I'm curious what happens when I do this. Look at that, we're going up. We're hungry, hungry hippos. <laughs> Huh. Space station. It's only using 2% of its power, so that must mean that the solar panels are actually doing a pretty damn good job. 
So then we do that, we do that. Cool. So 100% of fuel. Let's see. Let's go back out. And I need connection points. Can I put them on the wings, maybe? No. It wouldn't have been a good place, though. I'm trying to think. I mean, I know if I do it 10, 10 or so blocks back. How about over here? It's still got the mirrored on. So you're the center. Let's do 9. Let's do the little Tetris thing that I like to do. I don't know why, but I'm lagging. Oh darn, I need to do the other mirror too. Oh well. Practice. I was playing squad the other day, oh, yeah. and uh, it was the best I've ever done. Oh. Not in a tank, of course. And the tank's yep. a little sometimes can be a little cheaty. I had uh, 23 kills. Oh wow! Which I was pretty impressed about. <laughs> The one I, day that I decided not to stream it, I did really, really good. <laughs> Figures. I think I only had two deaths, so you know it's pretty, pretty good. All right, so ship still connects, and then we can dock. I think I might get rid of you and just put like a central spout. We'll leave that. Or to make, well, because of those stressors, I would want to do that. So that will be what I'm going to do. What, I, what I'd really like would be a hinge that would raise up and then you could go. But due to how you can't have multiple grids without building it, I don't really want to do it because I'm going to have to build two of these things. One of them will be refueling and the other will be the one that's being used. Alright, so now comes the fun part. My inner lights will come out. Okay. So, number five is probably that one, right? Because uh, it was the last one I added, and then we're going to turn it off so I can actually see that I got the right one. Look at that. Uh, remove. Okay, and then that means I can hide these two. Show terminal. Don't really want to see these anymore. Sweet. So that means all lights that I need to see are hidden. Which one has my lights? Okay. That is weird. I feel like I'm lagging. Like I'm really choppy. Alright, so Not I'm going to put Maybe it is. you. Alright, so you guys are going to be the red ones. Uh, blink interval is 3. And then we show in terminal. We do Shevin again. So we hide that and that. 
blink, blink, blink. And show terminal. Okay. So bright that you can't actually see them. So let's go into the dark side. Yeah, there they go. Let's see, we're gonna put light over here. And we're gonna hide that dude. Uh, show my terminal. Okay, we'll put you right there. I think I did it on the white one above. So one will be red, one will be green. Apparently, I'm gonna All right, so you're gonna be the red one, and you're gonna be the green one. Blink interval three, show and terminal. Which one's red? The front. That makes sense, I think. Okay, well, I feel like that works. Now, here comes the fun part. Can I make a blueprint? Nope. Okay. Options, game. Able Steam Cloud, okay. I gotta do this literally every time that I wanna make a blueprint. It's really frustrating. And we got it. Alright, so now we go back to the planet. Oh, hell. Splish splash. Where is the planet? Yeah, I don't think we're gonna be able to play this here. At least not until it. I don't know. Yeah. Um. Uh, here, let me let me back out. Let me just get rid of weapons mods. I don't need any on here. Settings, mods. Um, oops. Okay, good. Uh, okay. Review you. Don't need you. I needed that one. Hold on. Yep. So that doesn't really matter to you either. Should be a lot less than what it was. Okay. Like I let said, I just got rid of all the weapons packs, so. Okay. Well, let me know when you're back in your game and I'll try again. <laughs> However, I don't know how much longer I will I be able to stay awake for and get tired again. Mm hmm. Game crashed. <laughs> Rot -ra raggy. Yeah. It's just like any other game. Whenever you mod it, you do changes, and you come back in, it breaks. 
it crashes again, then that means I need one of the mods. What time do you usually go to bed now? 4.30. Okay. My day's off. It just varies crazily. Mm -mm. Okay, it's up. Well, nothing is exploding, so that's usually a positive sign. Yeah. Take out your profile. It disconnected you for some reason. Oh, it sure did. So we'll have to wait till you actually have internet. <laughs> In the meantime, I need to Google. All right, so no, like fourteen million kilograms. the weight large hydrogen thruster uh, max so 700 they've lowered it I feel like 734 kilograms hmm. oh hey look at that I only need uh, 365 megs to download instead of a, a gig and a half. Those <laughs> weapon packs are, jeez. Yeah, they, they are sometimes a little big. Let's, let's do the quick math real quick. 48. Okay. So we got 7, 3, 4, 6, 9, 4, divided by 4, 8. Nine eight zero. Okay, so I can either build fourteen, or pretty much fifteen small thrusters equal one large thruster. <laughs> so what's the mass of one of those? Okay. So it would, yeah, it, it's it's a lot more efficient just to build a large one. Okay, that's what I figured. A lot of people disagree with that. Time. So if they do 734,000 kilograms, how many do I need for... I just want to say, like, let's do 20 million. 20 million divided by a lot. Divided by 734, 694. So I need 30 large thrusters. Okay, that's a lot of thrust. Or I can make it where the thing only does half, so that would be 14 <coughs> large of these things. 
which I think will probably be the option to go with. 14 of these seems a lot more reasonable than 30. Don't you agree? Yes. Sure. Yeah, I can do I 10. I was in my own head. <laughs> you could want it. I would what you would call a space cowboy at the moment I was thinking about who knows what. Okay. All right, I'm going to set my, my earpiece down, and I'm gonna, I'll am gonna. i be right back. Okay. If I do 21, I can build this a little bit more even. Okay, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 1, 2, 3. Okay. This is like building the big hoss again. Um, let's do hydrogen. So let's do there four. I should mirror this. Scare of you and you. All right, so that's definitely not enough tanks for this thing. So we're going to do that. Uh, not. Almost a one to one or a one to two. I don't feel like we need to do that because of the update to the, the thrusters. All of this just to be able to move, you know, like 10 million kilograms of one resource. <laughs> but hey, it is worth it. Um, we're going to, but that on there. Hmm. <coughs> there had to be like a designated <coughs> launch pad I feel on on the planets for this thing. So let's do one, two, three. And then it's gotta go down at least six so that the, the block damage will not destroy anything. Okay, so now let's put some gyros. We're gonna put those. Let's do to here. So that's what, that's too many, I feel. Let's just do 16. All right, so now we got gyros. Large cargo container, I don't necessarily want it to, I want that all to be on its own grid, I feel like. Where's the middle at again? Right here, okay, so we're going to do this. And that's large. I will be <laughs> I 
That seems a little crazy that you need that much thrust to lift up one cargo container. Oh, yeah. I feel like I just want to test this out to make sure it's legit. Luckily, I'm in creative and I can do that. So we're going to do a couple of thrusters on the side. I'll do a couple like that. I, I just know the maths behind it is probably honestly true, but... Alright, we're going to set a big boy on top. Because we're going to have gravity to also assist us. Um, and we'll set you like so. Alright, what is it? Alt F10. Control F10. Uh... Shift up 10. There we go. Um, what's the easiest thing to do? Jump ship. Oh, you can't spawn in that much? What? Hmm. hmm. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So that's one million in mass. What you can you copy that? Okay, that's two million of mass. I think I'm I was wrong for some reason. <laughs> I don't know what I was doing math on then. Three, that makes four, two of five, us. six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, that's four million. No, I was right. I'm pretty sure of it anyway. <laughs> the twenty million might have been a little too much, but I think I was pretty close. Let's switch that to a nine. And that to a nine. And that to a nine. Two, three, four. All right, so that's half the container, which is eight million in mass. I feel like a couple of these thrusters might be able to go then. I think they're attached to something, aren't they? Yeah. Uh, no. Okay, so that's you know two big boys gone. And if, if this is the case, then I will happily change the configuration of this thing. All right, so let's control C. Um, this is big enough to be able to handle this, I think. Oh, it needs power. Oops. So a couple of reactors on, it doesn't matter. There we go. Okay. All right, we weigh a lot. Very easy. Okay. Okay, so that means I can probably go down more. Sweet. I think it took off pretty quick, didn't it? Shoot, you just have to do the initial jump and then you can just stop. It's so tiny compared to everything else over here. <laughs> it's so enjoyable. Alright. Goodbye to you and you. And you. Okay. That's a lot less thrusters than we started with. That's good. Right, we'll get rid of you.
Hmm. Anything else we need to get rid of? I don't think so. Wait, hold on. Who the phone? Let's put in a reactor. Now we can copy. It shouldn't fall to the ground. Keyword here. <laughs> All right. Once again, pretty much relative ease. So I don't think I can do maths. Or they've changed, and the, the form I was looking at is like a really old form. I didn't really look on the date. Point. Okay, so that means you can go. And that means all that can go. So that means this thing can be a lot smaller now. If it only requires six large thrusters to get this to move, that's going to be fantastic. <laughs> How much is this way now? 10 million. Oh yeah, I, I feel like that's perfect amount right there. Houston, we have takeoff. Hey, <laughs> you actually spawned. Well, your name did. Is. I? Your name did. Oh, you know, it'd be really fun. Let's turn it upside down. Man, 450 meters a second is booming. Uh, how do I roll again? There we go. Oh no. And... Deploy. We're still gonna go boom. <laughs> oh! Okay. That's a crater. Yep. Okay. I cannot imagine if I did that to your base whenever we were playing against each other. Yeah. Alright, so the good news is that works. Uh, let's do a battery or two. Uh, we'll place those right here. Let's get rid of these reactors. Let's put these boys over here. We'll do a couple less than what we did. Uh, we will... All right, let's go and park ourselves. This thing still moves so easily. I guess I don't have any factions, do I? Uh, nope. Chills Corp. Oh. There you go. If you want to join that. Huh. All at once, everybody became an enemy with me. That's not good. <laughs> Touchdown. Oh, that's not good. Uh, do you know And get rid of you. Sweet. So 
we went from that giant thing to this little thing that now is trying to fly away. Uh, okay. Oh no. Don't explode. Too late. Alright, this just means I know what I can do now. Okay. <laughs> uh, Are we in creative? Yes. Okay. So I can't die. I, I, if you want to join the faction, you can. There is no guns, really. Oh, no. I found a gun. Oh, probably one of the... Oh, I guess the aircraft, aircraft carrier. Yeah. Uh-huh, yeah. The wrong aircraft okay. carrier. For some reason, whenever I spawn in the, the new one, it doesn't actually spawn in. Uh, let's see. Let's do landing gear. Two. Six. And then we'll do. Well, you have a decent ping. Ping, yeah, it's not bad. I'm um, kind of surprised, to be honest. Okay, okay. we're going to do this. Uh, let's get rid of the landing gear. Okay, so we're going to put... So there are four blocks, gotcha. So that's three. right here. Oops. I wonder, is there a way to actually creatively set everybody your friend? I'm sure there is somehow. Um, cargo. No, let's do the tanks first. I feel like that just moves. Was that just my imagination? Probably was. Okay. So we're going to do little guys right there so that's the side thrust and it's the forward thrust and where are you at in relation to like your space station um, go towards the carrier you'll see me right there oh. You already went past me. I'm on the runway. Oh. I turned my uh, thing on so you can see me. Yeah, I don't see your beacon. Huh. Look for the giant yellow thing on the runway. Can't miss that. Or uh, Alt F10, show all players. Really? Um, so that goes down three and then down six. And then we do. Uh, let's get rid of get rid of you 
I can now put landing gear back in. Well, any of the builds look kind of cool, or they all suck? I like the, I like the, whatchamacallit, the space station. <laughs> is it obvious that that's what it is? Yeah, I mean, that's what I think it is. You're right, at least I hope, I hope you look at the right one. The yeah, one that so has like the, the, cent the central thing yep. with all the solar panels, yeah. Yep. Do you like the, uh, air traffic control tower? Mm-hmm. Looks good. This is the jump ship I just built. This is the old one, actually. The new one is up in space. And this this is my freight carrier. I went a little crazy. I figured it's in space. It doesn't have to be aerodynamic. Yeah. So that's why it's built the way that it is. And this thing is going to be so we can bring up resources by the large container size. Uh. Oh, this? Uh, follow me. This is my pride and joy. Well, one of my pride and joys now. I work very hard on this. You remember the uh, Astro Miner that we used to go from space to and all that? Uh huh, yeah. Welcome to its new brother that does not mime. Uh uh. Now, this is what it used to look like. This is the third iteration. If you come back here, so you have this beautiful thing right here. I worked mm -hmm. really hard on this one. This is its um, retarded brother we don't talk about. <laughs> so in the family, this is me. <laughs> but uh, it has a lot of storage. Yeah. I guess you can technically do the uh, F8 camera and look inside of it. So this one, as you can see, is like really freaking tall. Yeah. It's because I had to hide in all this stuff in here. Oh. Uh, all these hydrogen tanks and cargo, and I didn't want the hydrogen tanks and stuff to be, uh, you know, on top of the existing stuff. So then, uh, in one of the live streams, I crashed this, destroyed the whole front end. I was like, well, you know what that means? I can go and build a new one now. Yeah. So I worked very hard on this one. I spent a good couple hours on this guy. So this one has the exact same stuff that the other one has. I just very smartly placed it inside. <laughs> and as you can see, it's got the lights. If you want to have a sheet yeah it, it's it's definitely very thick <laughs> so when it's fully loaded it can take off pretty pretty easily but we're not fully loaded uh, let's not click that but yes we do have the airplane mod so that's why the wings are like they are. So remember me saying that my mouse, the middle mouse button click wasn't working? Uh-huh. I found it out yeah. it wasn't working on here. So that's why it's only one color. Oh. I couldn't color it. Now I can. I just haven't done it. But I kind of, it's kind of grown on me that it's the silver color. Yeah, it flies good. But as you see, it has the hydrogen, has ion thrusters and all that fun stuff. Yep. So let's, let's let's go on an adventure. All right. 
let's see, what is that? Five and seven. You're sitting in a ceiling for me. <laughs> I think you are too. I'm not even sitting. I'm. I don't know what I'm doing to be honest. Okay. <laughs> Oh, you're, you're in the chair. Not on my screen. Well, I mean, like you're you're sitting in it though. Not on my screen. Uh. <laughs> oh hey, nice face. Amazing. Welcome to oh, the space station. Cool. <laughs> the space oh, station boy. in space. Crazy. So the space station that's down there is not the the blueprinted one. This one is. Okay. So all the, and the jumper, as you can see, it's named. So you have the space station and the jumper over here. Uh... Oh boy, this sucks. Oh, this is not playable. Uh, you just let it load in. You know, you'll be fine. It's not even stream. It doesn't say, like, usually it would say streaming along the bottom. It doesn't even do that. Like I said, let it load in, because we did just kind of teleport pretty far away. Okay, there's the load in, I think. We're still moving, so it doesn't help any. I think this one's just wider. It's, just, it's not taller, it's just wider. I also had to add more wheels on this thing. Now we're stopping. And we're stopped. Are you opening the door? It's not very nice. I believe this one's actually pressurized too. Oh hey, I'm in the seat finally. <laughs> Holy cow. It's amazing. Yeah, there's not as much stuff to have to load up here. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, there's the uh, Mach 1 of the uh, jumper. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I got the big thrusters on. That does not help us at all. <laughs> Slow us down. Alright, I'm gonna hop out. So this is like a refinery or assembler or if you want to make like a dining area. Uh, the one that I have in my world, it's uh, got assemblers and refineries. It's already, you know, all I have to do is connect to this right here and you're connected. And they have thrusters on this, so you technically can turn it from a space station back into a ship. Um, this side 
Oh yeah, this one is. Uh... Did I not do the doors? I guess not. One, two, three. Show on terminal. Ugh. All right, groups closed. All doors just shut down at once. Oh, starting to pressurize in here. It will take it a very long time though, because there's just the one guy. Yeah. And it might not even be. Oh yeah, it is. Okay, the door shut. So theoretically, you know, it you can. Okay, and then if I open up this side, I can, you know, start pressurizing specific quadrants. I mean, eventually they'd all have their own system, but... Let's see if I just push you in there. I pretty much left it so like you, had, you could figure out whenever you spawn it in what you need it for at the time. Oh, uh, I was thinking goes. about there's a person that made like modules. Yeah. I was thinking about doing that. <sighs> Making a module modular space station and then like you could uh, build like something that brings up the the chunks. Yeah. <laughs> That'd be pretty cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, make this one do work too. Now, if I go up the ladder, what happens when I depressurize up here? I guess I can do that. I forgot I added another door. And you are okay. I mean, technically, this area is not supposed to be pressurized. That's why there's a double door. But, you know, stuff happens. How do I get out of here? There you are. Close the door. Whee! And then we can pressurize this now. You're supposed to shut the door. <laughs> It is just like a maintenance area. Yeah. But you could store quite a bit of resources in here. Yeah. You could even put refineries up here as well. Oh, yeah. I mean, it's, it's a two by two spot. Yeah, it's got it's got space. You could put a mass of O2 generators too. You could put batteries yeah. whatever honestly you need yeah it, it's meant f it's meant to you know be expandable on the sides you could even technically move the uh the cargo containers to the sides and you'd be able to triple what you got quadruple even Now, if you come with me, which way is the way out? This way. So that's how simple it is to depressurize and all that fun stuff. Where is... Don't have one, I don't think. Oh, I never showed you this. Oh man, I was so proud of this. It's in space, so it's not going to do anything, but... 
How do you like this apple? If it's spawned for yet. <laughs> Underneath you. I see nothing. Yeah, he'll, he'll find you eventually, oh. I'm sure. <laughs> this is not a workshop download. I made this. Actually, not what I was wanting to show. This should be on this world. Uh, new version of Space Engineers available. Oh, great. Uh, game. Do what? I just got told that there's a new version of Space Engineers. Oh, great. Yeah. They had to probably fix a bug. Um, what did I name that thing? I am not getting all my blueprints again. I thought I said accept, but apparently I didn't. Okay, let's try this one more thousand times. Uh, there we are. That might take you a moment to spawn in. Probably. Isn't it gravity generators nice? Let me know when the big thing below spawns in for you. Okay. Can't miss it. It's actually bigger than the space station. Whoop, going way so fast. Yeah, I think it's bigger in space. Well, I guess not. Lengthwise it is, but, or width. Yeah, well, maybe. Maybe it is bigger in space station. It doesn't, doesn't look like it. I believe I can fly. Hey, when I, hmm, just when I put anyone in here, but apparently not. Has it spawned in yet? Nope. The giant thing is moving towards you. Yeah, I I, I got nothing. Okay, well it's, it's it's gonna it's gonna hit you like a brick. Probably. <laughs> The game's gonna crash, and you know, no. Nah. Well, I'm moving it right next to you, so it's probably trying to load it. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. I mean, you already saw it on the planet, but now it's in space to where it actually can move. No, I missed. <laughs> Are you moving around at all? No, I'm just sitting here. Oh, I'm I'm moving now.
I'm putting you inside the ship. <laughs> <laughs> there he is. Oh, I'll just gotta go a little bit more over and you'll be in. Okay. There we are. I'm guessing you're in the. Oh, hi. Wait, let me see what this does. It's pressure. Is it pressure? Is it the, the gravity or the oxygen and all that going up for yeah, you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's pressurized. Space <laughs> is pressurized, everybody. <laughs> Congratulations, you did it. Uh huh. It, it was a lot of work. We can now live in outer space. <laughs> Jesus. See how sick oh. we get. <laughs> the character is probably freaking out. Like, what the hell's going on? <laughs> oh yeah, it's true. We could go. Let's, let's... We're definitely going on an adventure now. Because this thing has all those tanks. It will float. Mayday, mayday, we're going down. We're going this space to a planet. Suddenly, like an asteroid spawns right in front of me. Mm -hmm. Afraid no evasive maneuvers could be done. Yeah. I mean, this ship is about the size of an asteroid, to be honest. How fast is your character going? 170 and climbing. Okay. Hey, quit your licking. Let's see. Um, pretty sure it's a mod that's updating. Oh yeah, we're a big ship. We can go 400 meters a second. I'm still in space. Yeah, we, we, we still are. Not for much longer, though. As in, I'm not in any type of vehicle still. Yeah, yeah, I know. We're about to go splish splashing, though. Oh, speaking of meteorites, there's one. Whee! But it's, it's, it's like probably a kilometer away, so we're fine. Uh, the ship that we're traversing, and I've actually built on the, the survival world too. The like jump ship thing that I'm going to be working on. It's going to be probably supplying that, and then that ship will connect to the jumper ship, and it will go between planet 26 and then the home planet. And we'll have free reign to bring all the resources. Or I might just start a massive minor 89er expedition and process all the resources from that. Forty forty kilometers from there, so we should start hitting gravity. Oh, speaking of, there it goes. You should have gravity now. Point zero six. Seven. 
Let's see, what does this do? You should be able to walk around. Well, it'd be kind of hard to walk around, but yeah, you should be able to. What's weird is I'm just falling down at 200 meters a second, and yeah. What's really weird is the ship shouldn't be doing what it's doing, but it's doing it anyway. No, oh, okay. well, that's always good. <laughs> It's like imaginarily getting like aerodynamics, I don't know why. Uh. It's weird. We're on this planet, but yet we're not going any faster. Hmm. We're almost to where we started from. Come on. If you land <laughs> what that's looking at, that's not going to be good. Splish splash, here we go. Splash. Oh, oh. oh in the water. That, that, did you just crash? Yeah, we may have lost half the ship. Good news is, I can now, well. I don't, I was never in a ship, I just bounced off the, the bottom. Yeah, we, we bounced off the bottom. We, we, we lost uh, quite a big chunk of it. <laughs> so that means... Oh wow, yeah. I see the hole that you fell out of. <laughs> what was the ground at least respawn for you? Yeah, the ground, the ground, the ground spawned in. Spawned in and... Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the textures are very weird on this right now. It's not normal. You can see the grids. Yeah. Uh. Boink. Mm. Well, but I am going to call it a night. I'm going to get some sleep. Yeah, I'm probably going to call it for now because I'm hungry. <laughs> there you go. Alrighty. <sighs> Well, this was intriguing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you got to move in space with and breathe in space. I know. It's fantastic. Unloading world. I've never seen that before. Okay. Yeah, it usually does it when you log out. Uh, okay. All right. Well, I'll talk to you later. Yep. Have fun, buddy. You too. All right. Uh, bye. All right. Now it's time for me to go get food. I will probably finish this off off camera. And uh, when we come back, we're going to be in the survival world. And I'll be building this and attempting to build 
the one up there. Kind of scary. Just a wee bit scary. Alright. Bye.